three of my favorite travel activities are the beach, eating in cool places, and meeting other full-time travel families. We're setting off to do that this afternoon. Let's go! Mom? Let's go! Let's go. Let's go. Isaac! Let's go! Saptani Ria Yuti Kangwad Phuket Pratetai Tamriyama. Already at the beach. Maybe they are. Let's go. Sorry, we're late. Hello. We made it. So finally. glad you guys came. Hello again. Hello. Marissa. We just met. Introduce yourself. Yeah. <laughs> All right. My name is Marissa Johnson. We are a traveling family, kind of. Not as traveling as you guys, but um, still traveling. Not yes. Much. We also have a YouTube channel, and that's how we hooked up. Ours is called Living a Good Story. And just like you guys, we're just trying to go out there and live a little bit differently in a way that's honoring to us and feels right. That's right. <laughs> yeah. The Johnsons sold a lot of their stuff and Michael, Marissa's husband, quit his corporate job and they took off about two and a half years ago yep. for this free-spirited sort of life. That's right. Nothing better. So it's fun to meet up with people like you that yeah. are doing the same thing, especially when our kids get along and My have fun. And, and they're the same age. Yeah, living the dream. Living the dream. You That's know what? Right. Thanks for the introduction. Now it's beach time. Yeah. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's have fun. So I'm getting a board for Bella. She's going to surf. There are four things that make a great beach. One is that it's flat and sandy. Number two is that there's plenty of sunshine. Number three is great waves. <laughs> I don't know what's better. Sun, sandy gradual inclined beach, waves, Maybe the waves. Here's another one. <gasps> Number four is that it's not too... I guess I can't have it all. What's it like catching a wave? Um, well I can't really compare it to anything. Ineffable? What does that mean? Ineffable means unable to be described with words. Yeah! Is that word ineffable? Yeah! That's a good word.
salty, I'm sweaty, I'm sandy, and I'm tired. Now Renata's calling me, and I'm sure she's hungry. It is time to eat. There she is, right there. Time to go eat. When we started, I promised you that we were going to meet another full-time traveling family, the Johnsons. And then I also said we were going to go to the beach, which was awesome. And now, it's food time at the night market. The night market. The night market's just starting, so it's there isn't a lot of people out here, but I don't care. All I want is a bunch of food. Ooh. A bunch of delicious, cheap, tasty food. Shakes, fresh fruit, sushi, meat, kebabs, tacos, chicken, banana pancakes, whatever we want. Tacos? Yeah. Well, maybe burritos. Yeah, burritos. Let's go get some food. Yeah. One, three coconut, one passion fruit. Okay. Okay. You even put the coconut meat inside. This is the best shake. Coconut shake, coconut drink, whatever you want to call it. Ever. Fresh. This isn't even a Vitamix. Amazing. Yes, yes, people. I want one of these. I want to try one. You gonna try a silkworm? Whoa, a scorpion. Yes. Okay, no beetles. No beetles, no scorpions. No scorpions, but you're gonna go for some silkworm. All right. Yeah. Go ahead and pop in your mouth. Crunchy, it's really good. There's no word to describe the taste it of... Tastes like a silkworm. <laughs> it tastes like a silkworm, of course. Good job, you guys. I'm gonna eat more of that. It's really good. You're gonna have more silkworms? Yeah. I'm not gonna have any more. You don't like them? No. They're good. So I said if my children ate the silkworms, I'd give them 100 baht each. I ended up liking the silkworm. They're really good. Will you give me my hundred baht back? No. <laughs> Fine, I earned it. So right here we have crocodile. One crocodile and one deer. So there's my crocodile and deer. And since I'm having crocodile, I think I know who to pay. Ah, deer is just venison. But crocodile, I've never had before. It's crocodile. How is it? It's tough. It tastes like reptile. What does reptile taste like? Like chicken. Uh, everything <laughs> tastes like chicken. And this camera, it's like at 4%, so we gotta wrap the day up <laughs> and go home and go to sleep because we're wiped out. We are. Good night, everyone. Good night. All right, I did it. I ate a silkworm. <laughs>